Hello, this is RV Vagabond Jerry. And there's one more museum I want to show you here in Nashville, which is in downtown Nashville. It's the Country Music Hall of Fame Museum. It's very similar to the Musicians Hall of Fame Museum, but of course just concentrating on country music. So let's go in and take a look around, and then I'm going to take you out to a special place for lunch with me. Here's some displays for Gene Autry, Roy Rogers, and here's a dress that Minnie Pearl wore, and Eddie Arnold, Hank Williams. There's an old Warlet Sir jukebox. T. Texas Tyler, Spade Cooley, Merle Travis, Hank Thompson and Cindy Walker. That's things that they used. It's one of Hank Snow's outfits, banjo and guitar, and Lefty Frizzell. It's one of his. There's several more. Here's Jim Reeves, Don Gibson, the Browns. And here's some costumes that they wore. Here's one of the cars that Nudie customized. He was famous for horns on front and guns. <laughs> I don't think that would go over well anymore. Got a rifle in the back too. This was for Webb Pierce. Several guitars used by Chet Atkins. Got a nice tribute to Hee Haw. Charlie McCoy. And here's a steel guitar that was used for Tammy Wynette's band. See this tiny guitar? That was Tiny Moore's. Here's a big wall of gold records. They have a guitar workshop here. Here you go. This is a still that Tom T. Hall used. I think this is funny. They have a sticker on the floor to tell you where to stand to view the exhibit. <laughs> so you can't get close to the glass. You ever heard a little Doug song? There he is. And this is his triple neck steel guitar that he had customized. One of Roger Miller's guitars, Ray Charles's jackets, Cheney C. Riley's dress, Lynn Anderson. Here's the washboard from Nitty Gritty Dirt Band. By the way, did you know Freddie Fender took his name from having a Fender guitar that he played? The Fender brand guitar, which there's a lot of them in the museum here, and the other one, Musicians Hall of Fame, a lot of Fenders. Barbara Mandrell was famous for the steel guitar. And here's her four-arm guitar. Wow. There are so many outfits of the stars here. I'm just not going to go through them anymore. There's just so many. Oh, look at that pink one. Dolly's outfits. Here's the Smokey and the Bandits car. Here's a mock up of Taylor Swift's bus. This big round room.
it's lined with these plaques and this is what they look like when people were elected into the Hall of Fame this is their gift shop of course well folks this is all I'm going to show you there's another huge wall of gold and platinum records so now I'm going to take you out to lunch with me well now I'm downtown at Honky Tonk Central well now I'm going to go in here to have lunch at Nudie's Honky Tonk Nudie is the nickname of a man who designed, built a lot of costumes for celebrities, mostly singers, some of the more elaborate costumes that they wear, or mostly that they used to wear, the old style for the most part. And he also did some customizing of some cars. This is their top floor bar. We've never done this All American Redux song, but I was sit on the edge there. There's about two blocks here where it's just lined with bars and restaurants. And a lot of them, like the one I'm on, have the outdoor rooftop dining. And they have a couple of musicians up here. Here's some of the costumes that Nudie made for some of the celebrities, mostly singers. And here's some more things they have on the wall here. They have a five piece band playing right up front there. So they have live entertainment on the bottom floor and then also on the rooftop. And they have a gift shop here. hamburger and fries and a beer so that's gonna end my video here hope you enjoyed it good day folks